I'm going to share with you the latest update I got from Louis Vuitton on my return of the Capucins BB due to damage issue and my request for a replacement. So please stay tuned. <music> Hey guys, welcome back. I hope you're all doing great today. I have shared with you my issues with the bag, my Louis Vuitton Capucins BB, my advocacy for a replacement, and Louis Vuitton's stand and offer to repair free of charge, my refusal of the offer, of course, which led me to sort of like walk out and leave the bag. But the SA and manager were quick to inform me that if I leave the bag, they will proceed with the repair. So upon hearing that, I told them that I will resort to legal action if they won't agree to my terms. All this, by the way, happened when I brought the bag myself last Sunday as agreed upon so the store manager can take a look at the actual damage. This is just a recap of our conversation, guys. I mentioned this in the last video, so please watch. If you haven't done so, I'm going to put the link in the description box below. And of course, don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell for new videos. Thank you so much, guys. Anyway, the manager insisted free of charge repair, which Louis Vuitton Singapore told them to do. Again, I declined. I kept telling them that the bag is a luxury item, very expensive, and it's under five years. And I know my rights. And you know what? Most of the time I was there, they were silent. The SA and the store manager. But when I mentioned about legal actions, showed to them the video I've taken where... I store and display my bag, reiterating how I took care of it because the damage assessment was due to usage and storage. They could sense I wouldn't give up, so they told me that they'll get back to me after three days to know what Singapore has to say about my replacement claim. Once they came until afternoon, no one called, so I decided to drop off since I had to buy some personal things, but the SA was on day off. She's not my original SA, by the way. She's only assigned to deal with me on this particular case. But another SA, a guy spoke to me though and asked if I brought the bag. I said no because I didn't expect anything that day. But without fumbling, he said, we have not done this before and we will do it only for you. You can now choose a color you want if you prefer another color or replace with a different size with a consideration of the Capucin Baby's current price, which is 300 195,000 PHP. I got really, really excited about the result because I purchased it for 278,000 PHP. And the price now after three years, my goodness, it has gone up so much for like 117,000 plus. But the quality, some still have issues that needed to be fixed or corrected. I understand that the capucins are delicate and cannot be worn every day, so it's not an everyday bag. That's why I rotate my bags so it is hardly used. I also understand that the capucins are handmade and each is one of a kind. Unlike machine-made pieces which are mass-produced, handmade has the personal touch and is crafted with more attention to detail, typically constructed from higher quality materials, making it more durable than machine-made. The process of creating a handmade bag like the Capucins is time-consuming and labor-intensive. So with all these advantages, why the flows? Maybe it's the inspection people or team who inspects before shipping or maybe the designs making the bag or its part prone to issues or damages. I don't know. It's just my opinion, guys. Since I got the approval for a replacement, I haven't decided yet what option to take or to pick if I'm going to choose the same color, same size, or switch to another bag. I'm still thinking about it. I still have a few more days to decide whether I'm going to pick a bag that has a higher price than the Capucins BB or I could probably get a bag with a lower price plus accessory. I'm not sure, maybe two bags. I'll let you know next video and hopefully show you what I pick. I hope you find this topic useful, guys. 
If so, please give me a thumbs up and drop your comment down there. I will surely get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you so much for watching. Always stand for your rights.